This is a WXII 12 editorial by President and General Manager Michelle Bai. It's called Equal Pay Day, a symbolic day that shows how far into a new year a woman must work to be paid equal to what a man earned the previous year. This year, that day is March 14th, 2023. So this Tuesday will be the day when a woman has finally earned enough to catch up to her male counterpart's 2022 salary. That is, in a word, bunk. But it is the state of the gender pay gap in the U.S. Women working 40 hours a week earn 84% of their male peers. The statistics are more alarming for women of color. Black women earn at a rate of 67%, Latina and indigenous women at 57%. Fixing this problem demands that employers recognize the discrimination that exists in policies that limit paid family and medical leave, access to childcare, and outdated practices like basing employee pay on salary history when women already earn less than men. And don't tell me better legislation will help. The Equal Pay Act was established in 1963. Yet here I stand in 2023 with my 84 cents on the dollar. WXII 12 welcomes responsible replies to this editorial.